Let me show you how to easily create animations in Canva that will stop the scroll and keep your viewers engaged. Hey, I'm Sarah Nguyen, and on this channel, I help you grow your business using video and social media design with ease. If you're new here, consider subscribing for more of these tutorials. We're going to create amazing animations in Canva, and I promise it's easy even if you've never done any animating before. Canva animation is available for all Canva users, both Canva free and Canva pro. But make sure to check out my link in the description to get Canva pro free for 45 days so you can access all of the animation and premium elements for your designs. Let's get straight into the tutorial in Canva. So I'm going to show you three ways that you can animate in Canva. And I know you're really going to like this because they're super, super easy to do. Now, the first way to animate, and I'm assuming that you've got a design ready to go with elements that you want to have a play around with or you want to animate. So here is a beautiful design here, and I would like to animate this bird and make it move a little on the page. So what I do after adding the element or image that I want to animate is I select it, and then I select animate. You, it will appear here, right on the top menu. Alternatively, you can click on the element, and in the bottom right-hand corner, you can see Canva Assistant. And if you click on that and start typing animate, you can see the option to animate here. But I'm going to use the menu option. I've clicked on it. I'm going to go to animate here. Now, this first option is you're able to move the element and drag it to where you want it to go. So I'm going to select create an animation. And now I'm going to hold down the shift key and I'm going to drag the bird to go where I want. Right, so I'm going to make it swoop around and land on top here. So shift, click on the bird, drag and swoop around here. So now I can see the bird is animated. Now you're like, that's a little jagged. So what I can do is I can select smooth. So have it go a bit smoother or I can select steady and it will be like the steadier hand or I can click on this orient element to path button and this will make it animate in this cool little way. Now you may be saying, can I just do it in a curve? And at the time of this recording, you can't, but um, this is how you can animate in a kind of quick little way with a couple of movement styles. So rumor has it that they're working on those curves and it's coming, but at this moment in time, you can't. So that's the first option. You can select an, an image and then basically click the shift key and then drag it and then that will animate it for you. Now the second way to animate is that with Canva you can animate single elements or you can animate everything on the page automatically. So say you've got this beautiful design here and you simply want to animate or you want to have different animations for different elements. So let's just say I want the heart to have a different animation to the star. So I'm going to select the star select animate at the top and you can see here it's got page animations and element animations so we want to be on this element animation and then we choose the movement that we want so when you hover over them you can see the animation preview of what it would look like so I'm going to make this one rise so go from the bottom to the top go up so I select that and I also have the option here it's the rise animation but I can make it go the other way as well so you can go up or if I select, select down, it can go down. I can also change the speed. So let's say I need it to go really fast. Then I can preview it and see it there. Or I can slow it right down. I need it to go really slow. And then I can do that there. So you can choose whichever animation style you want. And the direction if that's available for that animation as well. So I'm going to choose rise. I'm going to have it go down. I'm going to increase the speed a little bit. And that's my animation there. So then I can select the star. So we had the heart rising. So we're going to now select the star and select animate. And now we can choose a different style. So the heart was rising. The star will be, let's have the star doing a bit of a tectonic movement. So I'm going to select tectonic and then I'm going to have the speed a little bit fast. So that's it, go a bit faster. 
There we go. So my heart's rising and the stars tectonic moving onto the page. Now, last but not least, you can also animate all of the elements on the page, but not have to do each one individually. So what you would do is once you have your design, once again, we're going to go up to the animate button here, click on that. You can see it says page animations and you can simply select a animation style and Canva will automatically populate all of the animations for you for all of the elements. So I'm going to go in and let's have a party. Let's choose the party animation. And then I'm going to leave it just for this page, but you can apply it to all the pages in your design. And that there has animated all the elements for me. So there you have it. That's how easy it is to create animations using Canva. I hope this video was helpful for you. And if it was, please hit the like button for me. And let me know in the comments section below what other Canva training you'd like to learn about. I love making these videos for you. In the meantime, why don't you check out my Canva playlist for more tutorials? Or if you're struggling to come up with what to say in your YouTube videos, you'll definitely want my five swipeable YouTube scripts. They'll help you come up with content for your videos that grabs your viewers' attention and increases your YouTube watch time. You can check them out by clicking on the screen and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.